I don't see how you can hate from outside of the club. You can't even get in. <laughs> Right now, I've been uh, working on my debut album, which is supposed to come out probably by the end of this year. It's almost done, like 90%, and that's been going incredible. We've been working on, on that over like the past two months. And um, Copy Paste is the first single off the album, and that uh, that came out like three weeks ago. So we shot the video for that yesterday also. My favorite song on the album is a song I have called Thank You. It makes me cry every time I sing it. It's about saying thank you to a guy for doing all the wrong things because he made me into a woman. Oh my gosh, nice. It's very personal. And what are you looking for? Forward to at the BET Awards tomorrow. I want to see Rick Ross perform. <laughs> I want to see him do that. That's your song, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that's my song. What? No, I, I get excited when you perform. It makes me happy. Okay. Um, no, I mean, that's hard to say. Maybe best female R&B because I wake up every day and I just try to be the best version of me I can be. And um, that may be a testament to the fact that I'm in great company. Um, and my, my work is, you know, every video, I, I pour my heart and soul into every video. So that is definitely an honor. Pretty Girl Rock is definitely an honor, but I think Best Female R&B might mean a little bit more. But I don't expect to win any of them, to be honest. Oh. <laughs> Why is that? I just never do. Okay. I wouldn't say it was hard. Uh, it was actually a really awesome experience because our producers were very loyal to us. Uh, we were not ambushed on our show. Nobody surprised us with a lot of stupid, you know, what we gave them was who we were and they protected us. They showed the truth. There were some things they didn't show that we let them see that they said, well, we're going to cover them on that. And so they were very good to us, so I don't regret it at all. Just did Jump in a Broom. It was very successful. It's actually out in the UK right now and in okay. South Africa. Okay. So shout out to the UK and South African fans that are supporting the film. But um, yeah, I have a film coming out in September called Straw Dogs. Okay. You know, and keep your eyes open for season two of Breakout Kings. Okay. Yeah. And you said that you are looking forward to Jump in the Broom with someone in real life. Absolutely. I mean, I don't have a someone to jump over the broom with. Okay. But when I do meet that person, I'm not opposed to it or afraid of it. Brooms were meant to be jumped over. So in a show called uh, Happily Divorced, Fran Drescher's new show. She used to be the nanny, and now she has a new show called Happily Divorced. We're on TV Land. It's at 30 at night at the Hot in Cleveland. And it's a really, really fun show. So if you two my gift and give me a platform in it. YBF, yes. my people, because y'all are from D.C., y'all are from the DMV, and I'm from the DMV.